and hugs. So today we're doing 10 lazy hacks. You guys love the first one I did and if you guys haven't watched that, you guys have to check it out. Just a disclaimer, a lot of these are actually jokes. Also right now I'm running a MacBook Air giveaway so if you guys want to be part of the giveaway, all you need to do is join this wonderful family here. And the only other thing you guys need to do is subscribe to Reacticorns which is linked down below. This week we're going to do another like challenge. Let's get this video to 158,000 likes. Mia is going to give you guys 3 seconds to do this. Ready? Three, two, one. Have you guys done it? Well, without further ado, let's get on with the video. Let's go. Never met a man like you. How many of you guys wear glasses or contacts? Well, if you regularly get your eyes checked, then well done to you. But if you're like me and are just way too lazy to get them checked regularly, you might find yourself in this situation. Hmm, I wonder what's on special today. Eh? What's that? Worst children? No, that doesn't sound right. Instead of getting your eyes checked like a normal person, you can just take out your phone, take a picture of the menu, and then zoom in on your phone screen to read what it says. I need those veggies washed, remember? You said you'd do it two hours ago. Okay, mom. Fine. So many. Mm. Yep, I am that lazy. I'd actually use a dishwasher to wash my vegetables. Obviously, this is a joke. Or is it? You might think this seems like a huge waste of water, but apparently just using the rinse cycle without detergent for most dishwashers only uses about one gallon of water. However, leaving a running faucet on in the sink uses about two gallons of water per minute. Now I don't know about you, but I don't think I'd be able to wash all these vegetables in 30 seconds. So even though this idea started out as a complete joke, I could actually be a genius. What do you guys think? You can have anything you want in the world Got a money tree in your backyard I don't know about you, but I generally like to keep my fridge pretty full Which can sometimes lead to me forgetting about leftovers Only to find them months later Ugh. Another problem I have is trying to figure out what I've put at the back of the fridge It doesn't help that I'm short as well So next time, instead of struggling to figure out what you put in the back of your fridge 6 months ago Just use a Lazy Susan Just pop it in one or more compartments and put your sauces or bottles or whatever you want on it Now whenever you want to grab something from the back, just give it a spin and voila! It's right in front of you This hack is honestly so good and kind of mesmerizing to look at uh, okay, moving on. Don't you hate it when your favorite shirt gets worn out and holes start appearing? Hey, don't judge. I love Batman, okay? So basically, you gotta either stitch it up or throw it out. But I have a super lazy hack for you guys. Just take some duct tape and stick it on the inside of your shirt and then use a sharpie to colour in the tape. This works best with black clothes, but you can also use coloured sharpies for coloured clothes as well. Just remember to remove the tape before you put it in the wash. Oh my gosh, no clean balls. What am I going to do? This super lazy hack is for when you're using the last serving of milk. By cutting the top off your milk bottle, you've now made your own cereal bowl with milk already inside. Then when you're done eating, you can just throw your bowl away with no cleanup. Warning, the lazy meter is extremely high with this hack. 
love hash browns, but cooking them in the oven when you're in a rush in the morning can really test your patience and hunger. So instead, an awesome way to save time and effort is to use a waffle maker instead. Just pop your hash brown inside and it'll be perfectly cooked in a few minutes. Mmm, hash browns. Hungry. <gasps> I guess you'll do for now. What the? Why do these tags even exist? Ugh, honestly. There, that'll teach you. I like to think that the planet's in space. It's super important to stay hydrated, guys, but don't you find coffee tables really awkward? Like, you gotta lean so far forward just to pick up or put down your cup. I don't know, it could just be me because I'm super lazy, but it's frustrating, right? So I actually DIY'd this huge long straw out of several smaller straws, just using some tape, and now I can sit back and drink whenever I want without ever having to get up. This hack actually has another secret use as well. Check this out. I really don't like putting away my clothes, but I've got a pretty cool shirt folding hack for those lazy people out there. You can basically fold any shirt in two seconds. Just pick up the shirt here and here, lift the corner up here, and then pick it up here, and you're done. I am not some furniture that's just lying around. Wanna see that again? Now that you've neatly folded all your clothes like a ninja, you can go back to being a lazy blob. I love watching shows on my laptop in bed. I actually can't even remember the last time I sat down to watch something. But honestly, guys, after a while, I get tired no matter what position I'm in. Either my neck gets sore or my arms get tired. But I found these awesome 90 degree viewing glasses online and I had to buy them. Basically, you put them on and it lets you see things at a 90 degree angle. So you can lie completely flat and still watch your favorite shows without exerting any energy at all. Hashtag lazy corns forever, right? They were like so much fun. Let me know which one your favorite is down below and let's have a look at what happened on Reacty Corns this week. Check out the lady's reflection in the mirror. You see an eerie face where you should see the back of her head. Yeah, she looks like she's looking back. Dude, yeah, what? Uh, she, it's like her face is double sided. It's like she's got another face behind her face. Okay guys, for behind the scenes and updates, don't forget to follow me on social medias. They're all here, all linked down below. Love to see you guys there. And I'm gonna miss you guys until next week. We're gonna have a new video then. All right guys, bye. Love you.